Hello there, welcome back to the channel. So are you using a Nothing Phone Mon with the latest Nothing Always? Well, after updating your Nothing Phone Mon, are you having trouble with the Wi-Fi? Well, your Nothing Phone Mon can have a different types of Wi-Fi issues like connected but no internet, can provide the internet, authentication error, Wi-Fi denied access, Wi-Fi keep disconnecting rapidly, Wi-Fi won't connect automatically, Wi-Fi keeps obtaining an IP address, and many more. First, let's go ahead and take a look at on the Nothing Support website. Well, they already have or they already given us some of the troubleshooting process on their website. So here, we'll make the whole things in a video format so that you can understand it better and can solve your problem almost immediately on your Nothing Phone 1. Well, first, let's go ahead and just fix the problem called connected but no internet or can provide the internet. Well, these two processes are similar, now to solve your problem, first, go ahead and swipe down from the top here and simply enable airplane mode and wait around 30 seconds. After that, just simply turn it off and check your problem. Now, if it sees, well, nothing changes, still you have the same problem, now just go ahead and restart your device. At the same time, go ahead and restart your router. Well, this problem can happen for your router at the same time. Well, after that, you'll be able to solve your problem called connected but no internet or can provide the internet on a nothing phone one. Now, let's go ahead and talk about the next problem called authentication error or Wi-Fi denied access or obtaining an IP address. Now, this problem mostly happens when you frequently enter the wrong password of your Wi-Fi router. So, here is what you can do. You can open up your settings and then you can tap on your network and internet and you can tap on your internet and you can choose your Wi-Fi router. Now, while you're entering the password, make sure to just enable this option called show password so that every time you're going to enter a password, you're going to be able to see it either you're entering a wrong password or the right password. Now, let's say you just enable this option, but the problem is every time you just try to connect your device, well, it only says keep authenticating or maybe it says keep obtaining an IP address. Or even if it says, well, cannot connect your Wi-Fi network, then go ahead and follow the next process. In the next process, you need to open up your settings, scroll down there, tap on system, tap on reset option, choose reset Wi-Fi mobile and Bluetooth, tap on reset settings, now simply draw your pattern and now tap reset settings, your device is going to reset the Wi-Fi network and your problem is going to be solved. Well, now let's say you did that process as well, but still it shows you keep authenticating or maybe it says you it can connect your device to the Wi-Fi router. In that case, lastly, all you gotta do is just simply reset up your Wi-Fi once again to solve that problem. Now let's move on and talk about the last problem which are called Wi-Fi keep disconnecting rapidly or Wi-Fi won't connect automatically. If you have this problem, follow this process. First, all you need to do on your nothing phone one here, open up a setting and scroll down to your about, tap on software info, just choose or just tap on your build number for about seven time unless it says you are a developer now. Get back here, tap on our system, tap on the developer option from there, scroll down and simply enable this option called Wi-Fi scan throttling. Now once you enable this option here, simply get out of here, just try to see whether your problem is solved or not. Well, if you see still you have the same problem here, there's a two last thing that you guys can do. Just go ahead and open up your settings, scroll down to your system, tap on software update and check for a new software update for your device. Now if any of those problems happening because of the software issue, updating your software to the latest nothing always will actually solve your problem. Now let's say you did all the process but nothing helps and lastly all you gotta do guys you gotta contact or communicate with the nothing support to get further help. Now here is I wanna just drop a quick bonus tip for all of you guys especially for Wi-Fi user if you're using your Wi-Fi like every day Please just try to turn off your Wi-Fi router, especially if you don't use it, because if you're going to keep connect your Wi-Fi to your mobile network, even if you don't use it, it can actually drain your battery. So these are all the things that you guys can do to solve your any problem that is connected with your Wi-Fi network. Hope you find this video useful. If you think so, go ahead and drop a like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching, and I'll talk to you later. Peace out.